This is Storm Track 12. Well, there's nothing like waking up on a spring morning to plenty of sunshine and blue skies, and that's exactly what we had here for this Tuesday. Still pretty sunny out there across the Twin Tiers, looking down towards Johnson City, 46 degrees, a breezy northwest wind as well at about 16 miles an hour. And again, we've been enjoying those clear skies all the way through the morning, and you can still see some of that clear sky, especially off to the east, but we're keeping our eyes to the west as a minor disturbance is going to start to bring the cloud cover back in pretty quickly this afternoon, and then eventually some light rainfall. You can see that already starting to extend into western New York and far northwestern Pennsylvania as that weak disturbance continues to track off to the east. But again, clear skies are hanging on for now, but you can again on satellite and radar see that cloud cover picking up a little bit here going to the west into Tioga County. Those temperatures out there have warmed up decently with that sunshine as well. We're seeing lower 50s in Appalachian and Owego and middle to upper 40s elsewhere across the viewing area as we get just past noon here. So that sunshine, yes, it is going to hold on just a little bit longer, but expect cloudier skies towards the middle and later part of the afternoon. And then some showers will be returning then for the early evening before retreating back to the south, giving us a dry day on Wednesday as that boundary goes down just to the south, but then comes right back on Thursday. And we stay pretty unsettled then for the end of the week. And we're watching the potential for some steady to heavy rainfall Friday into Saturday. But at least for the next few days, no concern with any heavy rainfall, but just some light showers. As you can see those clouds and then those showers moving in close to seven o'clock, setting up mainly to the southwest, but everybody has a chance to still see that light rainfall, at least through the early part of the overnight tonight. Then that boundary retreats and you can see how we dry things out Wednesday morning and for most of Wednesday afternoon as well. But there it makes its return again as we go through Wednesday on into Thursday as that chance for showers continues then as well into Thursday afternoon. We spoke a little bit about that heavy rainfall potential Friday into Saturday. There's that storm system that approaches from the west and moves in to the twin tiers. Then you can see these darker greens and yellows late on Friday into early Saturday morning. That's that steady rainfall. It's going to have a lot of warm, moist air with it. And because of that, we could see again that steady rainfall upwards of an inch within 24 hours. And we just saw heavy rainfall the other night. So this is something we're certainly going to be keeping an eye on moving forward. Temperatures today getting into the upper 50s. We cool things down pretty rapidly again tonight. Middle and lower 30s expected across the viewing area before Wednesday morning, but then tomorrow warming up pretty nicely getting back to near 60 degrees for the rest of the day today, though a little bit on the cooler side, lower 50s. Those showers are going to be returning later on in the day. And like I was speaking about Thursday and Friday, there's that heavier rainfall potential as we head into the weekend. But the Easter holiday looking pretty nice as the rainfall finally exits. Enjoy the sunshine while it's still around. That's exactly right. All right. Thanks, Damon. And thank you for joining us at noon.